What's up, guys? All right, so there's mail days and then there's mail days, all right? So what we're about to do right now, I live in Vancouver, so Washington State in the U.S. is very close to us, all right? So I have a box over there, and a lot of my eBay stuff goes there. But because of COVID, I just haven't been able to get any of it because we can't go over the border. So now my box informed us that they were going to start charging storage fees. So I had 45 items there. And to be honest, I don't remember what half of them are. So this box is full of all that stuff. So this is going to be an epic mail day. So I'm going to sit down here at the mat and we're going to start cracking this and we're going to reveal what's in here. Let's go. All right, guys. Okay, so I just cracked the box. So this is like... There's a lot of, look at this, there's a ton of stuff in here. <laughs> and they're just like throwing this stuff in. This is insane. Wow. That's what the box looks like. That's insane. All right, well, first of all, we got a Zion. Okay, there we go. We've got a, a Cabin Vigio 3D Demand rookie card. This card is so sick. You don't know how that one. Here we go. You know, 10. We got another Vigio. That's a yellow. 10 also. Super sick card. Except for it looks like the slab is. No, the slab's not too scratched up. Find out what's in there. We've got a jaw, nine, red, white, and blue. That looks like it's got a piece of plastic inside of it. That sucks. Thank you, PSA. We got a Lamar. I'll get that off later. We've got a jaw Morant, red prism which is kind of sick. We got my Jets, big Jets fan. Two Jets hats. What else we got in there? Let's see this real quick. Wow, this box is just jammed, guys. We got a Jets t-shirt. This thing is oh, freaking loaded. Another shirt for the kids. Seahawks for the wife. Jets jacket, and I'm pretty sure. Oh, we got shoes in here. What the heck? I don't know what are these. Oh, those are fire. I didn't know I had those. Sweet. <laughs> oh, COVID. You gotta love COVID. All right, guys. So the rest of this is all sports cards, which is crazy. Which is crazy. All right. All right. I'm gonna unpack. I'm gonna put it all out on the mat, and let's go through it. I'm kind of excited. Let's go. All right. So we can, I'll move this stuff up. All right. Let's just reach in the box and whatever we grab, we grab, right? Let's go. Where's my knife? Uh, the knife is right here. I'll grab that. All right. Let's see what we got here, guys. This is like Christmas. Okay, here we go. All right. Tops Chrome. Pete Alonzo 10. Okay, another good one. Let's just reach in, see what we grab here. Is this like a sticker? Yeah. There we go. Lamar. Crack that. Send that off to HGA. Thank you very much. Okay, here we go. What else is in here? Oh, okay, we got a mosaic. Uh, BGS 9. Uh, what do we got over here? We've got, all right, here we go. We got a Luca, Luca Base 9. We've got, all right, what's this one? 
Oh, I'm gonna like this one. Is this sealed? This is sealed, that's crazy. All right, let's see what we got here. We've got a Tatis, there we go. Tops Chrome, nine. Now guys, you gotta remember, I picked all of this stuff up like throughout the year. Like no joke, like from, from uh, basically like April on. Like we weren't allowed to go to the box anymore. So yeah, it's almost been like four years. Here we go. We've got oh, this one's nicely packed. We got an Mbappe base nine. This one I bought a while ago, so this one's definitely gone up in value. I bought some recently for around like two fifty, but this one's that one I think I got for like fifty. I want to say fifty bucks, but I don't know. Ooh, I see one in there that I'm going to save to the end. That thing is fire. All right. Let's see what else we got here. I'm going to cut my hand off. All right, we got another jaw. Red, white, and blue. Nine. Too bad the jaw is dropping a bit on us here since we bought all this crap. That's okay. What else we got here? We got... Bam. Another Zion, Mosaic. Let's just spread these slabs out. Let's get slabbed up. All right, here we go. Oh, I remember this one. So this is a, just a bunch of Biggio, uh, and I think there's a Vlad in there too. Or no, I bought this as a lot. I think I got this for like a dollar. There's like five of them in there. It's funny like how I remember all these. That's crazy. That 3D Biggio, I forgot I had that one. That one's that thing is freaking awesome. All right. So there you go. That's that's it so far. Let me put these ones over there. All right. Okay, guys, let's keep going in the box. Now, this one is not graded, but here's another Lamar. Ready to rookie. Put that guy there. Okay. What the heck is this? <sighs> Who's this? Okay. Let's see what we got here, guys. All right, so we got, uh, looks to be some more Biggio. I was buying a lot of, uh, Blue Jays are my team, so I was buying a ton of these lots last year when baseball was kind of cheap, so. Jeez, man, this is... I hate scotch tape. It just bends all the top loaders in there. All right, so we've got a Biggio Future Stars watch. And then, yeah, and then another one underneath. Guys, if you can avoid it, don't use scotch tape. It's just, it pulls, like, so much. You can bend the card inside the... Anyway, there we go. So we got another one of those. And that actually might have just been thrown in. I don't think I've actually bought that. I don't think I would have bought that anyway. Okay, guys, we'll keep going here. we we'll keep going. Stay with me. This is this is kind of crazy. It's like going into a time capsule. Oh, there we go. So that was not $35. There's no way I would have paid $35. But you can see I've got more Biggio. So clearly you can see I was hot on the Biggio. And for some reason... Oh, that's... You know what? I, still, I think that's all part of the same lot. I got a, a huge lot. It was like a... No joke. It was like a dollar seventy-five. I remember it was like late at night and I was just like, wow, this guy's just giving these away. All right, well, we can see what this is. This is a Zion Prism Base 9. Okay. There's Zion. I did a collection. Oh, what do we got here? We got a couple of New York Jet Magnets. Thought I grabbed everything. What's this? So this is oh here we go got another luca another luca base where's our lucas at right there all right we'll put that up there all right guys we've got oh i'm saving that one for the end i'm saving that one for the end that one is absolute fire all right there's i can't believe that everything's just in this box loose all right we got a jaw 8.5 in the centering there you can see that 
red, white, and blue BGS. Oh, here we go. Cunha Chrome Update 9.5 BGS. I'll move all these, I don't know, over there. There we go. Uh, what else we got here? We've got, I think this is two. Just two? Yeah. I think this is two more Lamars. I'm not going to unwrap this right now, but I'm pretty sure. Yeah, those are two more. I was buying Lamar. This was before the season. So this car dropped a bit, but after he had the whole poop incident, it kind of went up a little bit. All right, here we go. We got another Tatis. This is a nine. I think this is just paper. Yeah, this is just tops. So we got that. We've got, oh, these are nice. Look at that. Court Kings, John Morant. So as you can see, I was, uh, I was big on the jaw train. Oh, here we go. This is, this is a nice card. Allen and Ginter, PSA 10, Vladdy. Cool card. This is a cool card. Now, I bought this card for a buddy of mine. But then, <laughs> but then he decided he didn't want it anymore. So I'm going to keep it because I think it's cool. But it's a Alvin Kamara Spectra uh, rookie, uh, numbered 65 to 199. So it would be nice if there's an auto on there, but no auto. So cool card, though. And then the guy threw in some of these. Wild card, base. It's kind of funny. Anyway. Ain't nobody got time for that. Uh, what do we got here? Look at this. Look at this job. Look at this packing job. <laughs> there we go. Jaw emergent. Okay, all good, all good. Here we go with another. Oh, this one's. I love this card. The reactive blue debut. Jaw. Okay. Guys, this is fun. I hope you guys are enjoying this with me. This is like uh, it's like Christmas morning. This is crazy. I have no idea what's in here. I still don't know what's in here. Oh, this is the Teoscar. Ah. Oh, this is a different color than I thought it was going to be. So this Teoscar, I'm, like I said, big Blue Jays guy, but I also love Teoscar Hernandez. This is a cool card. So this one is a Topps Inception uh, Auto. Is that on card, dude? It's on card, 93 to 99. Rookie card. So that's a cool card. That's definitely a PC for sure. That's a cool card. Uh, what is this? We got another slab. We got another slab. Everybody. Okay, here we go. What do we got? Okay, so we got a, a Cunha Chrome Update, PSA 10. So again, guys, I was buying these back when these were nothing. Like, what did I pay for this? Oh, well, I paid one twenty for it. So, I mean, it wasn't a crazy deal, I guess. Uh, this is a cool card. Again, bought this for my buddy, but he doesn't want it anymore. So, there you go. Gen 10. Like, I'll definitely crack this. I'm not a big fan of uh, these slabs, but I'll crack it. And uh, I think this would look really good in an HGA slab. What do you guys think? I think that'd be good in an HGA slab. Holy cow, guys, we got more coming here. We got more. There we go. Vladdy, Tops Chrome. Vlad, PSA 9. I don't even know where to put all this stuff in uh garbage there we go what's in here what's in here see i got attacked here by myself steering the steering wheel backing into the driveway self-inflicted guys all right we got another lamar as you can see i was buying up lamar you know with the anticipation of getting it graded and doing all that fun stuff but good old COVID happens 
which is probably a good thing actually now that I have those because, like I said, his card dropped quite a bit last year. Not playing, not playing like he did as an MVP, that's for sure. Okay, this one's really wrapped up, guys. But oh, I have no idea what this is. I'm just as surprised as you. Oh yeah, this was a good purchase, I think. So this was a Joe Adele, uh, first Bowman, ten. This guy's a player for sure. For sure, he's a player. All right, we got another. Man, it's funny seeing some of the some of the packaging in here. So there's this range is all over the place. All right, who's this? Joe Burrow. Okay, so I bought this early, guys. I think I bought this like when uh, not a huge fan of the score, but I bought this when score probably first came out. So, you know, hype train, got to buy something. But, oh, that'll sell. All these LSU fans out there, unfortunately. Fight on, go Trojans. All right, here we go. What is in here, guys? What is in here? Holy cow, it's packed up. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. So now we've got another, this is a complete set. White jersey. 10 just paper okay so as you can see i was you know buying tatis at a good time because i didn't pay a lot for these which is good um okay guys couple more left bear with me this is hope you're having a lot as much fun as i am um let's see all right we got oh these are nicely packed look at those puppies Team bag or slab bag with the cardboard. I like that. I'm stealing that idea. With some wonky base. And nobody got time for that. All right. So there we go. So we got another complete set. Oh, we got more base. Here we go. Let's get pack the same base. Just not scratch it, which is good. So another Tatis. Uh, very good packaging on that one, guys, for sure. Actually, I think I know who that, that one might have been. I think I've ordered from this guy before. But I'm stealing this idea. Look at that. Slab bag with the cardboard inside. Like, that is dope. All right, shocker. We got another Tatis here. The Holiday. I think I bought this around the holidays. That was just like, kind of like it was. I think that one was too good to pass up. I think it was like, no joke. I think that was like 20 like 22 bucks, something like that, something crazy. It's funny how you remember some of these purchases even though it's been forever. All right, let's get into this guy. All right, there we go. What's in here, what's in here? All right, another jaw. I almost thought that was a silver for a second. Like, so I was buying a lot of jaw nines, as you can see. So, yeah, good purchase. I'm holding jaw. I mean, I'm not in a hurry to get rid of him. Okay, guys, so that's the box is done. I've got two left. So I've got two left. Let's take a look. So this is the second to last one. Another Luca. How many Lucas we have? One, two, three. One, two, yeah, three Lucas. Okay, let's throw that one up there. I'm covering up that Biggio. I want to. Let's keep that one on cover. That one's sick. That gold Biggio is so nice. Okay, guys. And this was probably my, probably the best purchase I made. And I got this card for $90. No, $83. Sorry, I just checked my sheet. Bam. There you go. Topps Chrome Pink Refractor. Now it is a nine, but this... I'm all about uh, color guys now. Like, honestly, like, there's some mistakes that I made here because I'm I'm really not into buying a bunch of base anymore. Um, but yeah, this is a nice card, this pink one, Tatis. So, yeah, guys, um, that was my mailbox. So let me uh, pick the camera up here. We'll go kind of go around the table. As you can see here, I bought a bunch of Biggio Raw, and then all of these slabs. This 3D card is pretty sick. A lot of red, white, and blue. But yeah, this is uh, 
this is fun to see. This uh, obviously one of my favorites. The Luca base will get going, but the yellow is a cool purchase. Um, you know, all the red, white, and blue stuff. I love this. Uh, Allen and Ginter. You know, PC. Um, and Mbappe I bought cheap. So all good turnarounds, guys. Pretty happy. Thanks, guys. I mean, I hope you guys had a lot of fun. That was like, uh, you know, a big kid on Christmas uh, opening that box. I've, you know, I've been trying to get updates about that box for for months now. I've been calling down to my box and, they, and they've been great. Uh, Mailbox International and Blaine. Uh, if, you ever, if you're in the Vancouver area and you need ever to uh, ship stuff from the States when COVID is over, super helpful. Uh, shipped everything up. I called them on Monday and I had it on Wednesday. So it cost me a little bit of money to get it here. Uh, but it is what it is. I got it now. Who knows how long the border is going to be closed. I do appreciate you guys watching. If you can like and subscribe, uh, I'm, I'm on TikTok as well, K2 Card Guy, but I'm trying to grow the uh, YouTube because um, I'm actually going to be putting on uh, a buddy of mine and a marketing firm here are going to be uh, putting together a card show when COVID breaks, hopefully in August here in Vancouver and uh, big things to come. And I'll keep you guys posted on on kind of that journey, we're going to be videoing a lot of it uh, as a vlog. And then next week, um, over spring break, uh, a friend of mine is opening up a card shop here in the Tri-Cities in Vancouver. So we're going to do a little diary of, uh, you know, the building of a sports card shop and do a little time lapse. So you guys can see, you know, what goes into opening a little, a little mom and pop card shop. So stay tuned for that also. Uh, this is episode two with K2 Card Guy, uh, edited by my guy, this Flyers fan. So let's go.